Let's transform this luxury car into a luxury home. Little John sold steamed buns for 10 years and effortlessly saved 500,000. He used to dream about a luxury car, beautiful women, and luxury villas in his life. Now, his dream has come true, but it's a little strange. Little John can only cry sadly every night. In the end, he decides to renovate his luxury car like this. Use galvanized square steel to weld a frame and borrow some screws from his sister-in-law to fasten it firmly to the car. Cover it with eco-friendly wood veneers for moisture-proof and sun-proof effects. Install windows to block wind and rain. The bed cabinet below holds his bits and pieces, and lay down a soft mattress so little John and his girlfriend can discuss life here. Make a large wardrobe beside the bed to store the clothes he usually wears. Install a socket to charge his phone, and add some books for bedtime reading. The lower drawer holds his underwear and socks. Put a modular cabinet in the middle, with a pool on the right, and an induction cooker on the left. A mirror above lets little John admire his beauty every day. The small compartment below is for feeding and toiletries. Install a wall-mounted toilet with a shower above for convenience, allowing him to do both at the same time. Add a bathroom heater to create a glass bathroom that's moisture-proof and odor-proof. Put in a movable table where little John can place his computer for work and study. It can also be used as a dining table. When not in use, it can be placed next to the bed to save space. Install a perforated board for fitness equipment and add a projector with a projection screen hanging at the end of the bed so he can enjoy Korean dramas every day. Now, let's take a look at the overall effect. Let's design a bedroom for 1 billion kids. My wife, who loves to have children, had more and more of them. 1 billion children were born accidentally, and the room is so full that they can't even fit in. So I use the long-lost martial arts secret, Buddha Palm, to directly penetrate the entire floor, expanding the space and reinstalling everything. Dig a round hole on each floor of the exterior wall and install extra-large exhaust fans to let the air circulate throughout the building, keeping it fresh. Then, I went to the scrap station and dug out a pile of galvanized square steel, wrapped it with eco-friendly wood veneers for 100 years of durability. Next, go to the second-hand market and buy some soft mattresses to make comfortable beds for the children. Each of the 1 billion children has their own separate bed, ensuring they don't make any noise and sleep well at night. Don't waste the space under the bed. Install long drawers large enough for children's clothes and socks. Install a ladder next to each bed, making it easier for the child to climb up. Remember that the floor slab was just welded and covered, making it beautiful, strong, and more durable. Install shopping mall living rooms between floors. Big investments bring high returns. For 1 billion kids, going up and down stairs is now easier and more convenient. Do not install traditional swing doors, as they can be easily broken by naughty children. Instead, install a heavy titanium alloy door that can withstand even Thor's sledgehammer. Then, install a face recognition system at the door to ensure only the right children enter and exit, preventing kids from other families from mixing in. Place several snack racks on the right side, filled with snacks that kids love, to encourage the habit of eating snacks every day. Arrange food stalls on the left with delicious snacks to fully satisfy every child's taste. Place bookshelves with cushions on both sides of the aisles so children can absorb knowledge and become useful members of society. Place desks and chairs by the window to create a study area for the children as eradicating illiteracy is everyone's responsibility. Place a large saint statue in the middle for children to worship every day, making Harvard University not just a dream. This is how I set up my home to easily accommodate one billion children. Multiple children bring multiple Multiple treasures, leading to happiness with fewer worries. This is the dream bedroom of every kid's. This bedroom is 10 square meters. Alice's dad set up a princess room for her, but there's not enough storage space. Alice has no place to study except on her bed, which wastes space. There's nowhere for her books and toys, causing arguments between her parents. Finally, her dad threw everything out and reorganized it like this. First, use galvanized square steel to make the bed frame and cover it with eco-friendly wood veneer. The bed frame is moisture-proof and breathable. Add a big mattress for Alice's bed. Attach a soft cushion around the wall so she can sleep comfortably without bumping her head. Create a hole in the wall beside the bed and insert a solid wood box, which encourages bedtime reading and can double as a bedside table. Install a switch socket by the bed, so Alice doesn't have to worry about turning off the lights at night. Next, make a wardrobe next to the bed with space at the top for storing off-season bedding. The bottom part is for hanging Alice's beautiful clothes, making them easy to see and choose from. Add step drawers under the bed seat for storing Alice's shorts and pantyhose, keeping them within easy reach. Add a partition at the end of the bed, with built-in folding windows, for ventilation and light. Install a wardrobe against the wall, to hang all of Alice's clothes, with cabinet doors for a neat and dust-free look. 
Include an open compartment next to it for storing frequently used and unused materials. Add a suspended desk with a seat underneath to ensure a good study environment. Create a low bookcase against the opposite wall for all her study books. Hang a pegboard by the door for her frequently worn coats and bags. The bedroom design includes a private sleeping area and a separate study area, making the room fully functional with double the storage space. This is how a modern kitchen should be styled in 2024. Instead of a single door sliding door that collects dirt, remove non-load bearing walls and create an integrated outer door cover. This setup doubles as a wine cabinet with easy access. Skip door stones and anti-slip bricks. Opt for large, easy to clean bricks leading to the kitchen. Don't clutter around the fridge. Relocate it and add tall cabinets above for rarely used items. Use pull-out cabinets on the side for dry ingredients. Avoid traditional right angle cabinets. Go for diamond shaped ones for more storage and convenience. Thin cabinets above are perfect for daily groceries, with a pull-out panel below and a nearby socket for kitchen appliances. Skip traditional wall cabinets and opt for drop-down baskets for easy access. Thin cabinets on the outside are great for storing less used bottles and jars. Add linear lights underneath for better visibility while cooking. Instead of base cabinet shelves that cause clutter, use multiple layers of drawers. Keep utensils on top and dishes below for better organization. Raise the sink area to avoid bending over while prepping food. Rather than installing a double sink that can't accommodate large pots, go for a large single sink for easier washing. Extend the countertop to the windowsill and add an extra drain basket for added convenience.